supplies. What's going on, everybody? So, I'm a little bit past due for uh, updating you guys. And uh, a lot of things have been going on in my life. Crazy things from everywhere, honestly. But uh, I had to get on here and tell you guys because there's so many rumors going around, so many people saying this, saying that, that I think it's time that I post a video and let you guys kind of know what's happening. I can't tell you everything, but I'm going to let you guys know now. I'm not driving anymore. Unfortunately, I'm off the road. Uh, they have the truck back. I believe it's going to be sold. I'm not 100% sure. But that's for them to do and not me. Uh, we had, everything was fine with Leslie. Great company, I love Ray. Uh, I just, I can't be on the road right now. I got things going on here at home. Since you guys know my grandma died and all that. I've gotta take care of the house and the property and everything back home and I got other things I need to take care of. Uh, I've seen a lot of rumors running around in the comments and a lot of people saying this and saying that. And nobody knows exactly what happened because I haven't told anybody and so that's that. I can't talk about any more of it. Oh, I can say that it's a bunch of bullshit and it shouldn't have never happened. So that's that. I'm gonna be fine. I'm going to fix it and I'm gonna keep on keeping on just like I always have. I've had a lot of time to do stuff here at home, which has been awesome. Been working on the Ranger, working on the bike, the mud trucks right there. I'll take you guys around that here at the end of the video and show you what I've done. I got a lawnmower now, hell yeah. Cub Cadet, I put a radio on it. <laughs> you guys are gonna like that. And uh, got the Tacoma all straightened out, all that kind of stuff. So it's been nice being home. I miss the road. I miss all my friends of the road. It really does suck. But you know, sometimes life throws you a curveball, and the only thing you can do is just, you know, swing at it the best you can and keep on running. Which is what I'm gonna do. Nothing's ever stopped me before. This isn't gonna stop me now. I'm probably gonna be driving again sometime most likely probably gonna do local though stay around here so i can come home every night you know try and get me something going you know a little bit more settled uh i miss the fast paced life of the road and all that stuff but you know everything works out for a reason god's got a weird way of making things work and i believe all this has happened for a reason just like whenever i got injured at yacht club and i ended up staying home you know right after that my grandma got hurt and you know eventually passed away and i was able to be home and see her for her last moment so i i strongly believe that god has a weird way of doing things and it's always for the best so i'm just gonna keep on swinging uh i want to run equipment now that i'm home i've always wanted to do that so i'm gonna start doing that uh the channel what's gonna happen with it most of you guys are here for the trucking and i completely understand that and after this video uh, i expect a lot of you to unsubscribe because there's not going to be trucking videos anymore and i've been watching youtube and looking at other things and i, I really like all forms of videos like i love review videos i'd love to do some review videos i also like you know the building the trucks and working on stuff and all that which uh, you i've already put some of that out there and doing moto vlogs and stuff so i'm thinking about just doing like an all-around channel because i know there's a lot of you it's a good solid 20 percent that still likes to watch my videos whether it's driving or it's not some of you are here for the mud truck some of you are here for the street bike some of you are here for the ranger and i i did that because it just in case anything ever happened with trucking and now look it has so i have these three things it's going to be the main focal point for a while until you know i can get my money back up and we can buy more cool stuff a boat and four wheelers and stuff like that and you know i'm just going to kind of do vlog styles i think of just everything i do i'm definitely going to do some review videos of things on wish and stuff like that because i just think those are the funniest videos ever especially the way that i do them because i mean the things that you get off there are just absolutely ridiculous and uh, I watch other review videos and I don't like the way people do them. They're funny and they do a good job, but there's some things I'm like, why aren't you touching this? Or like, that's not the way it works if you worked it like this. So that's that's what's going on, guys. I'm not driving anymore. It sucks, it really does. But like I said, you gotta keep on keeping on. It is what it is. You know, life throws you a curveball, you hit it. So show you guys the progress that I've made around the house. Oh, golly day, couldn't get it off there. So the bike is as it has been. It's completely fine. 
Um, this was all a mess when I got here. I've been reorganizing it and everything. It's it's still a mess. I'm still getting at it. You know, my cheap tools are over there. I got my snap-on tools in the bed in the bedroom. Here's my lawnmower I bought when I got home because I got a big yard here. I got a mow. I put a waterproof six and a halfs on it. Got this right there. Oh, it's it's real nice. Turns on with the key. Yeah, boy. I absolutely love that. I wish it would rain so I could mow the yard. I just put new tires on it. You know, got to have some beefy tires on there. My buddy stopped by when I got it. It was all black. And I washed it. You know, made it look real nice. Put tire shine on it. Yeah, my friends couldn't stop laughing. It was great. Got a welder. Got a little, you know, 120 volt welder back there. 220, whatever it is. Yeah, 120. So I'm going to start messing around with that. I don't know how to weld. I've done it once or twice. But there's things I want to do. So let's go to the mud truck. So I have put, where was it? So that alternator on it. And then I've put this alternator, which this is a 220. That one's a one. 100 and I, I still can't get the thing to charge um did the valve covers put nice chrome ones on there new gaskets a bunch of other stuff i changed the fans up put one big one on the back one small one on the front i've went through a bunch of stuff up here got it all right two new batteries uh so all that's good uh, i got these working this one only works halfway these all work now i've never really showed you guys the S10 like 110%. So I'm gonna show you guys now. I gotta plug it in. Hang on, I gotta connect the battery right here real quick. Let me take the battery tenderer off. There we go. And then I need to find a bass test song, a random one so I can show you guys. But uh, what did I, haven't i showed you i've showed you mainly all of it you've seen it it's got the girls and the rims and everything i absolutely love them so we've got all of these i think there's so three six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve yeah twelve of those four tweeters and then the system in the back we've got three twelves i just put this in because the amp that was on it those didn't work so four thousand watts right there that amp i don't know what it is but it runs the door speakers and stuff so let me take you up here and show you in here so i added i added a temperature sensor i shoved it into the radiator it was made for the block but i wanted to know what the radiator was at and what the block's at so we have got our oil pressure right here that's the head temperature and this one is the radiator temperature obviously our volts that so and she's she's running great now i replaced all the wires all the plugs also wrapped the headers i did a whole bunch of stuff so now she's fired right out but i can't get it to 14 volts and that's wrong, it's actually only like 12, if that. So it's like, oh! But it's charging somehow, but it's not giving me the whole thing. But, and you flip this switch. And so, this base knob wasn't working whenever I first had the radio hooked up. So I added in this one for the new amp, which then this one started working for some reason. But let me throw this on, and I'll show you guys the system real quick. All right, hang on. I got to uh, find a song that I can play on YouTube and not get in trouble. All right, so shout out to the music you need with this extreme no copyright YouTube. There's no copyright right here. Bass boosted music, so shout out to him. Looks like he's got a bunch of followers. 146,000. So go give him a follow for this. But here we go. I'm gonna try and get the door to stay open, which I have this two by four right here for. So I'll show you guys how far you can walk away and it's still crispy clear. Sorry, it's been a while since I recorded. Not real good at it no more. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna do that. And we're gonna go like this. Brothers 
pretty loud. I didn't know any voice like So that's that. <laughs> Here is the blue lights that are underneath. You got them all through there, all up underneath there, all through here. It's absolutely awesome. I love it. So, all right, here's the header wrap, John. I did a horrible job, but it's working. It's keeping a lot of the heat out. Spark plugs aren't firing every minute, so that's why it's good. So you guys are gonna see a lot of this truck, hopefully. I wanna take it to all the mud bogs around here. And it's not really like, a sink it up to the doors kind of mug truck because of obviously all the radio equipment inside so i won't be doing that no oh, come on put this thing back on charge so i won't be doing that really but i mean i'll take it up to the floorboards so all right that's oh, what the heck is going on my glasses here but anyway so yeah i'm cleaning up my yard doing all kinds of stuff around here Here's a yule old Tacoma. She's still doing good. I've got it all cleaned up. Cleaned up the inside real nice. Gotta get these scratches off of it, but. So yeah, I've just been, you know, getting my life back together because I've been gone for almost three years now. So, uh, what else was I gonna tell you guys? Oh, there was something else. Crap. I can't think, hang on. Sorry about that. Had to walk in a couple circles circles to remember. I'm still gonna do game streaming. I'm really gonna do that. I've been on, I gotta figure out how to stream my Xbox through the laptop so that way I can stream it on YouTube because I've been playing a lot of Call of Duty, GTA. I mainly just build cars on GTA. There ain't much to show, but I've been playing a lot of Call of Duty. So if you guys wanna see that, you know, go ahead. Uh, I think the name of the channel is going to be changing to High Strung Vlogs because I'm not behind the wheel anymore. If you guys have any other ideas on names and stuff, I'd love for you to hear them. I'm thinking about, I'm still thinking about the 100,000 giveaway because I don't know what to do now because I'm not driving. I kind of don't want to accept the reward because I'm, it's not going to be under what I've been doing. I feel like I don't deserve the plaque at 100,000 for trucking when I'm not trucking anymore. So got a bunch of different dilemmas i've been trying to figure out i didn't know how i wanted to explain it to you guys what's happening because i've got to be very careful with what i say i can't say much of anything so once i am i'm going to fill you guys in on everything don't worry about it you will know so please keep your negative comments down just please understand my privacy which is pretty much zero whenever you have a channel that's the size of this so if you could please you know respect my privacy as much as you could please understand i will be letting you guys know you know all the details of everything that's happened in my life when i can because it's gonna be a big thing so i hope all of you are doing great i hope your families are doing well i hope you had an awesome memorial day weekend god bless america and we're gonna see you on the next vlog don't forget to drop your ideas and if you guys are still sticking around and gonna support me through these hard times drop a comment below i love you guys have a good one